full of greatness, pigment, melanin, and courageous, gender, queer, to spirit, trans, elevate us across the Beautiful beings, bienvenido. My first name is Kua Jasiri, and my pronouns are the one and this one. I am the founding steward of Authentic Creations, publishing Apothecary, and I want to take a moment to pause to come into our bodies and tap into our spiritual presence. In this video, I want to go in on altar spaces. -na 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 -na. So this is the space I use for my altar space and my internet. So I want to go in on like how to create an altar space. So um, first, I recommend clearing off any altar items that you have cleaning them, anything that you want to put on your altar, cleaning that, um, cleaning off the space that you want to use, um, and then kind of evaluating your space. I have this tabletop. It has this like see-through nook, and then for my like power supply for the internet, and then I also have this little kind of like caddy. So I do want to do a disclaimer none of this that I'm putting up is my actual altar space. I love to keep my spiritual practice private, um, but also want to share with you all what you can do. So um, I also wanted to go just really quickly on an altar box. So this is my actual altar box, or half of it, um, the bottom. And so I have been really nomadic and transient, and something that really grounds me is having a little box to put all my altar stuff in, upside down. Um, so I definitely recommend that, especially if you're not ready for like a whole altar scene. The box is really great. You put some like key items in it, and then it's very portable. This is like smaller than my hands, deep as like half a finger, and I really encourage you to do art on it. I did collage, let's see, mariposa, some I love words, inspirational words, um, some reminders, so I definitely recommend that. I put all of my altar items in here, especially when I'm traveling, put the lid on, and I have this like sacred box with me. So um, I definitely recommend that. So on to the space. So I have these cables and stuff, so I first recommend kind of blocking out some stuff, right? Make sure your spiritual space is a little bit separate from electronics and stuff. Definitely want to just like pop a candle in there. I definitely love candles. I love starting with some kind of tray or mat. To kind of, um, I guess ancestrally the genderqueer people of my traditions place the mats and make the mats. So I honor that. If you have any medicines that you take regularly or that you use spiritually, so, and then like I said, velas, I love a candle, right, I'm just like, more candles. And then, okay, if you can, some living beings are really nice in the space. So this is just like a really quick, I also keep all my seeds <laughs> right near my altar space. This is the pigeon that ran into our window that I harvested. So then, you know, figure out what you want, start moving it around, trying to 
create a space that works for you. And like I said, this is not my altar. I am just looking at it. I'm like, whoa, this is so different than what I normally do. Um, I use a lot of charms. So um, there's just like objects or beings. Like this could be a charm. This feather would remind me of something and I would like place it as like that reminder. Some people use charms as protectants. Um, I really like some piedra, some rocks in there. I have my matches stick under here. And with a few other items, if I'm like journaling, I love that um, erasing ink because I love making sure the message is tailored to me. Okay, I'm just like, ooh, this is cute. I really love this. I might add like some water, maybe if it's like in here or just like a little glass of water, maybe here. These are some flowers, some flowers from the outside. This is a pimiento, a pepper plant, meung. Um, so yeah, just like a little quickie, how to build an altar, what works for you light up all the candles and um, yeah I recommend changing out your space every so often maybe moonly and not necessarily changing it all but just taking it off wiping it off and kind of re rebooting I'm personally like wow this is a really <laughs> amazing space um, yeah that I created here with you all so thank you so much give a little angles um, I want to thank our patrons and our community people who are on our blog and are following our YouTube channel as always we value you